The Lipscomb Bangerang Ultimate Frisbee teams took their first road trip of the 2013 season to Conway, Arkansas to play teams throughout the region. The Bangerang's captain, Cameron Gilliam, describes the experience. As far as the longest road trip, it was a lot of fun. That's all hanging out in the car. There's something that brings the team together when you travel together. And we got to stay at uh, me and Mariah's house. The girls stayed at Mariah's, the guys stayed at mine. So it was a lot of fun. We all uh, had a spaghetti dinner and got to hang out at Mariah's last night. So uh, we had, had a good little team party. Uh, it just really, it's, it's cool to see the family nature that develops uh, when we all get to hang out together like this. I think that's the reason, honestly, probably more than half of the people that are on this. Like, the competition is fun, uh, but the family and the community is even better. So it's good to be a part of it. The girls captain, Jacqueline Schunk, describes the strength of the Lady Bangerings. <laughs> well, we have a pretty aggressive team when it comes out to defense, and in all of our other sports, we, um, we're better defensively, so I think that just kind of comes, comes with the team, but better offense comes from better defense. So. The game experience was a valuable learning tool for the girls team. Um, one of the biggest things that we learned was um, that sometimes you can learn it in practice and have it shown to you and run it in practice, but you're never really going to know how it's played until you play it in a game. And our girls came out and learned a lot because there's a lot of stuff that we didn't go through in practice. So we were really able to learn a lot more than we could teach in practice. So it was really good. Um. It was really fun for a first tournament. It was a blast to get everyone together. I'm really glad the guys and the girls' teams got to end up playing. The Ultimate Frisbee team enjoyed their longest road trip and bonding experience, making their team stronger. This has been Chad Batson for Illumination News.